it tells us that there is activity in this supervolcano which erupts roughly every 600 million years. The U.S. Geological Survey, USGS, reported about 1,000 earthquakes under the Yellowstone volcano. Yellowstone Park has been closed, a team of scientists together with the outstanding physicist Michio Kaku. They pay special attention to this park of possible geological activities. Let's figure out what's going on there. Yellowstone National Park, located primarily in the U.S. state of Wyoming but also extending into Montana and Idaho, is widely recognized as the world's first national park and a landmark in the history of conservation and environmental protection. Its unique geothermal features, such as geysers and hot springs, along with its diverse wildlife and breathtaking landscapes, make it a popular destination for tourists and researchers alike. Let's start our journey with the latest news from Yellowstone Park. The U.S. Geological Survey, USGS, reported about 1,000 earthquakes under the Yellowstone volcano. Experts predict an increase in seismic activity in the coming days in this region. The USGS has submitted its monthly report, which reports that in July 2021, 1,008 earthquakes were recorded in Yellowstone National Park. The earthquakes were recorded by the Yellowstone Seismic Network, supported by the University of Utah. The U.S. Geological Survey reported that this is only a preliminary analysis, and the number of tremors is likely to increase. According to them, dozens of small earthquakes are expected in the coming days. According to experts, such earthquakes are usually associated with the ongoing movement of faults caused by the rise of groundwater. The strongest earthquake was recorded last month 17 kilometers under Yellowstone Lake. Its magnitude was 3.6. This seismic event was part of a chain of earthquakes that began on July 15, 2021. Experts reported that this level of seismicity is above average, but this situation is not a sign of an impending eruption of Yellowstone. The Yellowstone supervolcano, extending over an area measuring 69 by 45 kilometers in the west of the North American continent, is one of the most seismically active regions of the United States. Yellowstone Volcano has been the site of three catastrophic eruptions, which experts estimate occurred about 2.1 million, 1.3 million, and 640,000 years ago. As a result of the eruptions that occurred in ancient times, most of the territory of North America was covered with a thick layer of ash. If an eruption of the same force occurs now, precipitation will disrupt climate models and have a negative impact on global food production. Scientists also pay attention to the fact that Yellowstone does not erupt like clockwork every 600, 700,000 years as researchers previously believed, and that a catastrophic event can occur at any moment. Therefore, geologists still have concerns about the awakening of the volcano. History of the Park Before European settlers arrived, Native American tribes had lived in and around the Yellowstone region for thousands of years. Several tribes, including the Shoshone, Crow, Blackfeet, and Nez Perce, used the area for hunting, gathering, and spiritual purposes. The park's geothermal features also held cultural significance for these tribes. The first documented exploration of the Yellowstone region by a European-American was likely that of John Coulter, a member of the Lewis and Clark expedition. In 1807 to 1808, Coulter explored the area and reported back with incredible tales of geysers, hot springs, and other geothermal features. However, his stories were met with skepticism. In the 1870s, Ferdinand V. Hayden, a geologist and surveyor, led several expeditions to the Yellowstone area. His expeditions included artists, photographers, and scientists who documented the region's unique natural wonders. Their reports and images helped generate interest in the preservation of the area. As interest in preserving Yellowstone's natural beauty grew, a group of concerned individuals lobbied for the creation of a national park to protect it from commercial development and exploitation. On March 1, 1872, President Ulysses S. Grant signed the Yellowstone National Park Protection Act into law, officially establishing Yellowstone as the first national park in the United States and the world. In the early years of the park's existence, there were challenges in managing and protecting its resources. The U.S. Army was initially responsible for overseeing the park, as its primary role was to prevent poaching and vandalism. In 1916, the National Park Service was established to manage all national parks, and Yellowstone became one of its flagship properties. The expansion of railroads and the development of better transportation routes made Yellowstone more accessible to tourists. As a result, the park's popularity grew, leading to concerns about how to balance tourism with conservation. 
efforts were made to build infrastructure that accommodated visitors while minimizing environmental impact. Over the years, Yellowstone faced numerous challenges, including forest fires, invasive species, and conflicts between wildlife and human activity. Conservationists worked to address these challenges and implement sustainable management practices to ensure the park's long-term health and preservation. Yellowstone's geothermal features continued to intrigue scientists, leading to ongoing research about the geology and ecology of the area. Notably, geysers like Old Faithful became iconic symbols of the park, attracting millions of visitors. Yellowstone National Park's creation set a precedent for the conservation of natural areas worldwide. Its success influenced the establishment of national parks and protected areas in other countries, leading to the global conservation movement. Today, Yellowstone remains an important site for both scientific research and public enjoyment, showcasing the delicate balance between human recreation and the preservation of natural wonders. Yellowstone National Park spans approximately 2.2 million acres, 8,900 square kilometers, and is located primarily in the U.S. state of Wyoming, but it also extends into parts of Montana and Idaho. The park is known for its diverse landscapes, geothermal features, and unique ecosystems. The park sits atop the Yellowstone Caldera, a massive volcanic crater formed by a series of ancient volcanic eruptions. This caldera is responsible for the geothermal activity that gives Yellowstone its iconic features, such as geysers, hot springs, fumaroles, and mud pots. The most famous geyser, Old Faithful, is located in the Upper Geyser Basin. Yellowstone is surrounded by several mountain ranges, including the Absaroka Range to the east and the Gallatin Range to the northwest. These ranges contribute to the park's rugged and varied terrain. Yellowstone contains numerous lakes and rivers. Yellowstone Lake, one of the largest high-elevation lakes in North America, is located in the southeastern part of the park. The Yellowstone River flows through the park and eventually exits to the north, creating the iconic Yellowstone Falls and the Grand Canyon of the Yellowstone. The Grand Canyon of the Yellowstone is a dramatic gorge carved by the Yellowstone River. It features colorful rock formations and two impressive waterfalls, Upper Falls and Lower Falls. The Lamar Valley is another notable area, known for its wide open spaces and abundant wildlife. Large plateaus and meadows are scattered throughout the park. The Hayden Valley, for example, is a prime area for wildlife viewing and offers expansive views of the landscape. The park's diverse ecosystems range from grasslands and meadows to alpine tundra and dense forests. It's home to various plant and animal species, including grizzly bears, wolves, elk, bison, pronghorn, and more. The geothermal features also support unique microorganisms that thrive in the extreme conditions. The park's elevation varies considerably, with the lowest point being at Reese Creek, 5,282 feet or 1,610 meters, and the highest point at Eagle Peak, 11,358 feet or 3,462 meters. This range in elevation contributes to the park's diverse landscapes and habitats. Yellowstone contains several thermal areas, each with its own distinct features. Some of the well-known areas include Mammoth Hot Springs, Norris Geyser Basin, and the aforementioned Upper Geyser Basin.